Okay, so before we get into the news section, I thought we would uh, talk about this new idea for contributor spotlight. Uh, basically, we want to uh, focus on one contributor who's you know done a lot for the site. Do and, a spotlight. Yeah. Write a little write a profile on him. Um, and then one of the other things we're thinking of is doing, uh, you'll get, if you're the contributor of the month or whatever, contributor uh-huh. spotlight, you get to be on the podcast or, you know, we'll, like, we'll like record it. Yeah. We'll record an interview with you separately and then put it on the podcast. You right. won't be like live. Cause that's too hard. To unless do. you live in Colorado and, and want to drive over here. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Unless you want to, if you want to drive here, you can be on the podcast if you're the contributor of the month. Um, and then maybe like a special thing, um, yeah, like a little badge, a little badge on the site, when so the everyone knows. Yeah, gets rolling, <clears throat> which is always down the road. But yeah, and on, uh, for people who are doing adding content to the site now, just so you know, when we add the point system, it's retroactive. Yes. So you will get points for things you're doing now, even though we don't have the point system up yet. Yes. It's not like you're going to get screwed. Right. It's not going to start from zero. So, just FYI. Uh Uh-huh. Yes, Uh it's all retroactive. It's all... So don't hold back content. Right, yeah. (laughs) yeah. Not that anyone is. to post a guide for some game because there's no point system yet. But if you are waiting to post a guide because you want full control over it, yeah, do wait for that. Yeah, absolutely. Because you'll be... That should be in the next month. Right, or yeah, two, I think. Yeah, once you get back from mm-hmm. England. The guides thing, that's whew, that's being a lot tougher than I imagined. But uh, achievements list, cheats list, reviews, like screenshots. Um, videos. Videos, or I mean, like a trailer I th- section. I think there should be a videos section, and then uh, once you like make a video section, you can click add... Trailer subpage, add preview subpage, add review subpage. So you click videos and you'll see trailers, previews, reviews. Oh, like a video review? Mm-hmm. Ew. You don't think that'd be better under well, the section? you can include section? it. You could be in the... Re- it could be both. I, th- I don't know. I just think there should be a video tab with subsections for... Yeah. Different kinds of videos. But I don't think reviews would or, be Okay, that. glitches. Glitch okay. videos, or but then you, you don't think that'd be better under like its own wiki subpage for glitches? I'm just trying to make examples, man. I'm <laughs> pulling things out of my ass. Okay, well, okay, like I... the Bioshock Two Minecraft video. Uh huh. Like something weird yeah. that doesn't fit somewhere that's, else. That's yeah, that's random. Okay, but that's not. Okay. All right, leave me alone. Hey, <laughs> I, I, I I've been running this through my head many, many, many. Yeah, many, and I'm giving times. you my suggestions. Okay. Just because it's many times through your head isn't as good as one time through my oh, head. Oh, right. Got it. <laughs> Thanks. News. Gaming news. So we're all going to do one-shot podcast. Mm-hmm. No intermission, bitches. <laughs> news. EA buys Angry Birds publisher Chilingo. Chilingo also published uh, Defender Chronicles. Okay. So they published a lot of good games, and they published the new Cut the Rope game, but they are published. not they are not the developers of Angry Birds or Cut the Rope. They're just the publisher. So right. I think EA is relying on their relationships to keep you know, going yes, with that. They're buying their talent. Yeah. So that's kind of interesting. Uh, you don't hear about that too often: buying a publisher versus buying the development studio. I mean, yeah. The fuck does the publisher do? Nothing. Right. Nothing that's not easily replaceable by someone else. Developers. Especially since EA is a publisher. Right. You think they could just make deals. Like, the the people who make Angry Birds are probably so stoked to work with EA. Mm Mm-hmm. Or maybe they're like, oh, fuck that. Maybe, uh, what's the name of the publisher? Chilingo. Chilingo. Maybe the developer of Angry Birds and developer, or developer, Defender Chronicles, signed exclusive contracts with Chilingo that EA purchased. Could be. What the fuck? The publishers? No one likes publishers. All they do well, is... They're, you know, they do the advertising. Right. 
that's not easily replaced by someone else. Well, oh, yeah, talented. it can go to either way. They're not like the talent that makes the product. They're just. It's it's but like there saying, could be a good pu- be, having a good publisher can make the difference. Oh yeah, it's like saying that the agent makes the football player. Right, or saying that they get their cut. They're fucking schmucks. Twentieth Century Fox versus Paramount right. makes a better movie. Right. No. No. The director makes than the act. Yeah. Exactly. That's why I don't. That's why this is a weird acquisition. Yeah, but uh, chilinga has been publishing some great iPhone games. Mm-hmm. Like I've seen their names several times with games I really like. Mm-hmm. So hopefully that pans out for them. They bought it for twenty mil. It's a lot of money. Uh, some good news for Steam. They hit the 30 million user mark. 30? 30. Oh. So, uh... That is a lot. Valve has announced that it has 30 million accounts and has seen sales growths of more than 200% over the last year. So that's, that's huge. huge. That's humongous. And pff, Steam is great service. Have you ever used it? Yeah. When I got my new PC, I wanted to try it out. Oh, yeah, you used my Steam account to download. And then Bioshock. when it came out for Max, I downloaded it, and uh, that same week, Portal was free. Oh, that's right. I, I got Portal for free on there, which was awesome. That. And I loved that was my first time playing all the way through Portal. Yeah, Steam is good. I. Uh... And they have those sales. They have pretty good sales. Like over the summer, yes. they had some really, really good I sales. About that. They always do amazing sales. Unlike, so just wait, unlike, <laughs> wait for the summer. Yeah. Like, most digital retailers like Xbox Live or the PlayStation Network or uh, what other ones are there? That's all I can think of. Wii Store. Well, the Wii Store, and then there's Direct to Drive, which is something else similar to Steam. Yeah. Like they they don't really do sales the way that Steam does. Steam iPhone. Does, Steam does like the blowout App Store. sales, like legitimate blowout sales, where they'll sell. Every game ever made by 2K for 50 bucks. Yeah. Or, yeah. Well, see, like, the App Store for iPhone has sales individually. There's never, like, a store-wide sale. Well, it, that's, you're right. That's up to the publisher. Cause, yeah. Or the developer, or whoever. Yeah. Um, well, I'm sure it's up to the developer or the publisher on Steam, too. Oh, yeah. They're probably like, hey, we're doing a huge sale. Do you want in? Right. <laughs> They're like, yeah. Please. Yes. Yes, I'll sell all these old games that aren't selling anymore yeah. for... And you're selling code. The, price. Right. the only cost bandwidth. is bandwidth. Right. Which I'm. Yeah. I, I don't know who puts that bill. But. I guarantee, with the amount of bandwidth they have, that it's cheap, real cheap. Oh, per product sold. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. So the uh, the connect, uh, Microsoft is preparing to do what it does, does, <laughs> does best. Don't do what Donny. Don't does. <laughs> Throw money at it. Gobs and gobs of money. The New York Post reports that the company is set to kick off a five hundred dollar five hundred million dollar marketing campaign for this holiday season. That's insane. That's half a billion dollars. Yeah. That is a lot of money. To push the connect. Yes. Now read the next story and then go to the list of connect releases. We'll, we'll do. Okay, so I want to read the list of Connect releases because okay. they're so fucking retarded. Okay, continue. Uh, so uh, their most, well, I think this is, and I was like five. You're gonna blow five hundred million dollars, and then they did this. They got Connect on Oprah. Mm-hmm. This is the smartest fucking thing they could have done. Oh, those women that want to do yoga. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Best thing they could have done. I'm like, you okay, you and this five hundred million dollar thing might pay off now. Uh, so on Oprah, they gave a. Uh, everybody in the audience, a free Xbox and a Kinect. Um, the show's theme was the next big thing. So Microsoft paid for like the whole show. And uh, it says, Oprah's audience certainly seemed excited about the product, and based on the Kinect's target demographics, a room full of screaming middle-aged women on Oprah must be music to Microsoft's ears. Like, this is genius marketing. Like, I thought they would just, you know do full blowout ads on GameStop.com or something. Right. Like, shake your mouse like it's a person right. in Ad- front of the Connect. Advertise on NFL Sundays. Yeah. Like like the way that Call of Duty is going to be advertised. So kind of they are... Not. And, okay, so... They're advertising in Martha Magazine. And this is exactly... 
exactly how I see the Kinect succeeding. Uh-huh. I don't see it as a competitor to Wii or uh, Move. It's not for, like, gaming. It's for workout games. It's for dance games. Mm-hmm. It's like... It's more like Guitar Hero than... Like, the Wii is the fucking console. How much is the Kinect bundle? 150 No way. Oh, the Kinect is 150 Okay, for, oh, one the of these middle-aged, for one of these middle-aged women... Three... I think it's 300 with the arcade. That's a lot. That's more than a Wii. Yeah. But not more than a Wii. $100 more than a Wii. But not more than a Wii plus the balance board. Right. So they're definitely at the same price point. Mm Mm-hmm. Hmm. Okay, so I'll let you... uh... Oh, it's the the official release list, or the official list of the games that are being released with the Kinect has launched. And stop me if there's a game that you actually want to play. Okay, I don't know what Connect Adventures is, but Just it's judge one that solely okay. judge a game by its cover. Don't want to play it. Connect Adventures, Connectimals. One. Con- Look, we'll say Connect Adventures is the bundled one. Oh, the is rest included of with them every are instance. actually cheaper than normal games. None of them are at sixty. Hmm. Uh, Connectimals. Nope. Game Party colon in motion. Nope. For 40, 40 bones. Uh, Harry Potter and the Deathly Hall- Hollows Part One, Definitely the video not. game. Your Shape Fitness Evolved. No. Dance Central. Yes. Yes, I actually kind of do want to play. <laughs> uh, the Biggest Loser Ultimate Workout. You, yes, me, no. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm fine with my shape. Uh, Dance Masters. No. EA Sports Active 2. Yes. Really? Yeah, I think that'll... It's 100 look, bucks. Yeah. Why is that 100 bucks? A heart, heart rate, rate monitor? I think that will be like a legit workout thing. I'd like to see it kick my ass. And I guarantee it can. Like, Active, EA Active got really good reviews on the Wii. Okay. I think Active 2 is going to be, like, a well-polished workout simulator thing. I'm interested. Okay, I'm interested. Okay. Zumba Fitness? No, I'm not interested. What is that? Don't care. Don't know. Zumba. Uh, Connect Sports? Yeah. Really? Yeah. I guarantee it's going to suck. Well, I want to try it. I want to try it too, but I'm not going to pay 50 okay, bucks for it. Okay, I'm medium interested. Uh, motion sports? Medium interested. Deca Sports Freedom? No. Nope. Connect Joyride? Nope. Adrenaline Misfits? Mm. So that's like children snowboarding. Uh, okay, no. Fighters Uncaged? Yes. And Sonic Free interested Riders? Interested in Fighters Uncaged. Kia, Kia! There's not one kia, of those... Okay. Kia, 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 kia. We had a long discussion <laughs> during the Medal of Honor Tier 1 guide about... Metacritic scores and how seventy five is below is bad for Metacritic games. Yeah, uh, now one of these is going to get above like an eighty five. Well, they're not games though. The ones that I'm interested in aren't game. Okay, the dance one is kind of a game. The... But like yoga, I'd do a yoga one. I obviously need to stretch. I have right. like serious no, problems. That's my that's my point. They're not they're not games. Right. I if I want that. to exercise, I will go to the gym. It's not or, me. I know, I know. That's... If I could pay 50 bucks to have someone tell me what to do, that's all I need. Someone to tell me what to do, and I get achievements for it. Dude, I've got... <laughs> oh, you, oh, you want achievements? Oh, my God. I How awesome is that? that? Dude, I've got P90X on my computer if you really want to do an exercise thing. I don't want to die. I want to do an easy connect workout. Yeah, exactly. I don't want to do point. P90X. You I want to be like, iron. You want to think <laughs> you're working out. All right. And it's better than not thinking I'm working out. Move on. I don't want to get into this. I think it's going to be a lot more successful than initially in, I mean, initially anticipated. anticipated. Yeah. Okay. Great. I think I they're marketing I still it couldn't care the less. right way. I still do not care at all. Mm-hmm. There's not. Dude, how stoked would you be if your mom got a connect for the Biggest Loser workout? Or an mm-hmm. Xbox? Mm-hmm. You're like, fuck yeah, I just got an Xbox. You're like, Mom, pick up Halo Yeah. while you're out there. That's true. It is a that double threat. That would be threat. sweet. It is a double threat. Like on way. Christmas, Mom gets the connect with thing, kid mm-hmm. gets connectimals, older brother gets Halo. That's a And then you bundle. get the Xbox Live Gold family four-pack for 100 bucks a year. Mm-hmm. It's not a bad deal. Jesus, 100 bucks a year for four gold accounts? Yeah. Whew. It's cheap. It's cheaper than individually, but still. Yeah. Okay, well, continue. Okay. Connect blows and I'll never play it.
Oh, you will, because we're going to get one. Really? Yeah. 